Hey teacher friend, it's Christina from Mrs. Winter's Bliss. I am making this video because sometimes people get errors in files and the problem 99% of the time is that files are not being opened in Adobe. So I just wanted to show you really quickly how you know if you are opening your file in Adobe. So I went to my store and I downloaded this file here. It's a free file so I could show you. Um, and when I click download, it opened a little um, uh, prompting down here and I clicked open. When I clicked open, now I am in this, um, this browser, which I am now on the internet or in a temporary browser that is not opening in Adobe. I know that because at the top, I do not see anything that says Adobe at the top. Um, it's really dark black and dark gray. Um, and you can see the pages here um, in this little pane, this little pane right here. Um, so what happens is if you buy editable files or files who that have special fonts, often when you open it, it's not going to look right at all. And you're going to be like, oh my gosh. So the trick is, is that when you download a file, you should, instead of just clicking open, right click and then open in Adobe. Because you can see when you open in Adobe, you have this very light gray um, background. You have up here this little red icon that says PDF, open in Adobe. You have this other kind of pane that shows you. This is definitely open in Adobe, in your Adobe Reader. And you can even, <clears throat> And you can see everything like editable is like, you know, it's it looks how it's supposed to look. The font isn't distorted. Everything looks correct in the way that you would expect it to look. Um, you can see it says secured. Whereas again, when we open in that internet browser window, it looks very different and you're going to often get errors. Um, even if you don't see errors, Sometimes when you print, you're going to get errors, things will get cut off, or certain parts of the page will have errors, or even the clip art has errors and things like that. So I just wanted to point out how you know. Um, my suggestion is when you get that little box um, to download, let's try it really quick. So if I click download, I'm gonna get a little um, box over here. Let's see. Maybe it's, oh, yep, right here. When you do that, what I like to do is you can open, um, show in your finder if you're on a Mac, um, or show where you have it and then just save it right away. Or you can open it and then you can download, click the download button, and then just save it wherever you want to save it and then reopen. And you would just click, um, right click, and then open in Adobe. Let's see if I can do that um, for you. I'd have to go to a file, um, like right here. I would just right click and then open with Adobe. And then that makes sure that I'm opening the file with my Adobe Reader, you can see. Okay, I hope that's helpful for you. If you have any questions, feel free to reach out and I'll be happy to help. Thanks.